Hello YouTubers, Des here. Just found something very interesting. I've actually been at it already. It's a fan motor of um, a lady's uh, brushed hair heating, yeah, what they use for the hair. So it combs her hair, it swivels around, combs her hair and blows that hair into it and that, yeah. Anyway, looking at it, I noticed four, four well, they look like diodes. So I'm going to say it's a bridge rectifier. Not sure whether it is, because I'm not an electronic genius, but I found out that it doesn't matter which way around I connect the polarity. If I connect it, because oh, the two wires, I've cut the two wires off and that, but if I connect it this way, the fan blows air up to the motor. You can't really see it properly, I know it's... Uh, you really actually you'd be in seat better, but if you do it the other way around, still blowing air up to the motor. Uh, actually, I could probably show that with a piece of blue towel. So if I connect this up like this, and you can see you can see that the the fan is blowing. I swap the terminals around. A bit, a bit finicky these the silicon ones and yeah see it's blowing again it's, it's it makes it go one way and not the other but if I disconnect the two the diodes connect one onto there and one onto it says trying to get it on nothing Put it that way, it's blowing it. Yep. Swap the terminals round. Red's on that side, black's on that side. It's blowing it again. So, yeah, interesting. Probably uh, somebody like Big Clive would know more about this, but uh, yeah. I believe that's a bridge rectifier because four diodes and they're facing the, the polarities the right way around. So, but I just don't understand why, well, there's probably an exa a, a scientific reason why it makes the motor, whichever the polarity is, go the same way when these are connected up. Yeah, interesting. Look for comments below.